hello guys how are you all i hope all are good so guys uh, today we will see uh, so how we can add amount in our razor pay dashboard for example if you want to pay amount from razor pay to any customer then how you can do that for that we need amount in our razor pay dashboard right and whatever the amount we are getting from customer that is we are receiving from them to in our uh, bank account okay but if you want to pay from razor pay to the customer then how you can do that means how we can add the amount that we will see guys for that what you need to do just go in razor pay means just log in with razor pay account then go in accounts and settings here you need to check for payments and refunds in payments and refunds in this under you, you need to go to balance okay so if you come here in balance you will see guys here there is a current here you can see current balance is zero and reserve balance is also zero zero because we have not added anything here suppose if any amount is there then it will show guys here okay then uh, you can check here also documentation you will get here also guys you will get some steps steps that is uh, there are two types of balance available on the dashboard that is current balance and reserve balance here you can see current balance and reserve balance or uh, you can see guys what is current balance after the deduction of fees and tax the payment received from the customers are added to your merchant balance or current balance okay means whatever the amount we are receiving from our customer that will be considered as current balance according to a settlement cycle okay and reserve balance is nothing but reserve balance allows you to process refund or settlement to link accounts even if you do not have a sufficient current balance the amount you add to the as the reserve balance becomes a maximum negative limit for your account okay so this is the reserve balance guys, guys where we can add the amount okay and if you can watch this video also here also they have provided how we can add the amount okay so there are two methods one is by upi also we can add the amount so if you are if you're using upi then there is a steps just go in accounts and settings then payments and refunds means balances under payments and refunds then add the amount just click on this when you click on this you will get two options like upi and bank transfers so if you want to do upi just click on upi transaction then you need to add the description and all then add credits so when you add the credits enter the email and contact number it will ask that pop-up message will ask then you will see this pop-up message then just scan and pay the amount guys this will be credited in your dashboard okay and here you can see guys if you added any amount it will take maximum two to three hours to reserve the balance means to reflect in your reserve pay account it will take maximum two to three hours if you have deposited any amount okay and there is one more method that is bank transfer so this by using this also you can do the uh, you can add the amount okay so you can see guys add funds same process is there in balances sorry in payments and refunds balances then add fund then bank transfer and here you will get like this option this is the account number of raise pay okay and here we need to select the register account number only for example if you want to transfer amount from bank then that bank details only register it should register with raise up account means whatever the bank details we add that should be same then only we can add the amount okay so here also it will take two to three hours guys to reflect the amount in our raise up dashboard okay so here you will get the documents how we can do and all and if you go here that manage alerts here you can manage the alerts also for example if the current balance is uh, uh, below 10 or it, if it is 10 then it will give alert guys like amount is this much and all you can add like that okay so right now we don't want this so i'll remove this okay here you can see reserve balance just click on this add funds select upi payment if you want to do upi, UPI then continue here you need to add what means description i will add here reserve balance amount add here amount then click on add credits guys when you do add credits you will get one pop this razor pay dash checkout page then you can add the amount okay here you can see guys it is showing up something went wrong no appropriate payment method found okay so here i'm getting some error so that i have to check guys or it might be uh, any issue with this or i have to communicate with customer care so like this you can add the amount guys and whatever the error i'm facing here so this is the upi transaction guys then if you go here bank transfer just go here continue select here your register bank details 
then go back here also you will get one pop up message okay so so right now i'm facing issue guys so this i will communicate with customer and will tell you guys if you are you are also facing the same issue just comment it guys in my comment so it's means i will understand whether only i am facing that issue or if you are also facing that issue okay so guys will i will come with answer also why that error is coming okay and i hope guys you got how we can add the amount when you add the amount now that time uh, you will see the amount here guys we will see like this the view will be like this guys after adding the amount okay you can see here we need to scan and we need to add this page is not opening for me okay it is showing some uh, payment method issue might be from razor pay so that I have to check okay so i hope guys you got this uh suppose if you have any question regarding this thing guys please comment in comment box and if you are liking my videos then like share and subscribe to my channel 